CIDBT 4107, Dogs and the Law. This course is an exclusive home study academic course, which will require a lot of research. There are no workshops to attend. It is without equivocation one of the best in Britain today. The course is written not only for the dog professional, but for those wanting to have a better understanding of the complexities of dog law. Unfortunately, like most branches of the law, the law is not straightforward. In some parts by reason of the way in which it was framed, and that uncertainty exists in other parts. Canine professions this course is particularly useful for are dog walkers, dog trainers, dog behaviorists, kennel staff and owners, dog groomers, dog show managers and breeders, and council and government administrators in child fostering and enforcing agencies. There are many other canine disciplines that this course will be important for. In addition, this course is designed to enable you to study the basics of dog law by carrying out research, learning and understanding the basics of the legislation and relevant dog laws that all professional dog trainers should know. And it will help you and your clients to become more informed and responsible dog owners. The law that you will study will be that of dog owners and their dogs in England and Wales, although applying to Scotland in some instances. The aim of this course will direct you to relevant legislation and enable you to identify pertinent legislation concerning dog law. By understanding the legislation and being able to impart this information to owners when dealing with them and their dogs. We as dog owners may have dogs which display undesirable behavioural actions, which could lead us into trouble or even unwittingly breaking the law. This could be behavioural problems, displayed aggression to people or other dogs and animals. By better understanding the legislation, your responsibilities and that of others who may have charge, care or control over your dog, or you whilst in charge of other dogs. The course is delivered over three phases, covering such areas as ownership and dog theft, dog owners' responsibilities as covered under strict liability and negligence rules, dogs on the road and legal consequence, trespassing with dogs, wearing of collars and dealing with stray dogs, general welfare of dogs and owners' responsibility under the Animal Welfare Acts. By completing this course, you will have a better knowledge of dog law, which will enable you to stay within the law when training and advising owners or clients, understanding how not to break the law when doing so, knowing what to do if you or they find themselves in a situation having contravened legislation relating dogs. As a professional dog instructor, trainer and or owner, when working with and alongside clients, that you have a responsibility to know and ensure that the advice you give to owners is correct and current. Once you start your studies, you will see and learn that there are many rules and regulations some made by Acts of Parliament and others by case law, which governs people's responsibilities for various acts done by a dog or owner. By better understanding these rules and acts, you will be in a better position of liability unwittingly. You will develop an awareness of the complexities of the legislation, when to use the legislation to your advantage and protection, and that of owners that you will meet and deal with whilst working with them. If you wish to take your career further within the dog discipline arena, then this is a field of learning that you really do need to understand and will make you stand out. A must for the professional dog trainer behaviourist. Other pertinent legislation connected to dogs is also covered in the study programme and may have an impact on the advice or training you do with dogs and their owners. Successful students will build a good understanding of basic dog law and you will have a much deeper understanding of the legislation placing you at the top of your profession.